Sales statuses help you keep track of your pipeline. For example, we have a few opportunities in contact and many more with quote requested. You can save a pipeline view like this and share it with the rest of the company. You can also link statuses through progressions. For example, in contact moves to quote requested and quote requested moves to quote sent. This ensures that your team knows how to drive sales forward. To set up statuses and progressions, click on the configuration gear and you'll come to this screen where you can click on the sales type, in this case, automated example. To connect statuses to each other, like in contact and quote requested, simply add a new progression and drag and drop them together like this. A common challenge is knowing what to do between statuses, and Excello answers that with templated actions. You can bake in best practices and lessons learned. For example, in contact moves to quote requested and prompts me to create a reminder task to create the quote and it even gives new hires instructions on how to do so. Let's add some more helpful activities, such as an email to thank the potential client and to let them know when we'll get back to them. I'm writing to the sales contact, and I'll title the email for internal purposes. Then I'll give a subject to the email. I can use the merge fields on the right to make the email feel more personal as I write out the body and less like it's coming through a system. And then lastly, I'll sign off as myself. And now, let's see this in action. As I move from in contact to quote requested, we're prompted with that task to create a quote with instructions for how to do it. And then next, that email that I wrote with his name, my name, and also their company already pulled in. So instead of taking five minutes to draft this out and send it off, now I'm spending five seconds. And on top of that, this email that's being sent out is written in the tone and the message that has grown your agency to the size it is today.